John? All right, thanks, pal. 917 now on your Friday. It is time for In the Know, and a very special one, actually, today. We're talking about an inaugural tour for an event that bills itself as now your grandpappy's rodeo, capturing attention in its home region of the southeast, now embarking on a 21-city journey to bring nonstop entertainment to Peoria now and central Illinois. And this is entertainment unlike any you've seen before. And joining us today to share more about all the excitement and what you can expect is one of the men bringing it to you, Josh Porkshop Garrett. Josh, my man, thanks for being here today. Oh, man, thank you guys for having us. Super excited to be in Peoria. Uh, bulls, bands, and barrels. It is going to be so much fun. All right, Triple B, we got to talk all about this. People have been seeing the ads. I've talked to people on the street who are excited about this. If you were to summarize what people can expect, oh my what gosh. would you say? So it is a one-of-a-kind deal. It's not like anything else going up and down the road right now. Um, the three, what we think, are the three most exciting parts of Western sports industry, the bull riding, the barrel racing, and the American freestyle bullfights. We do all of that, lots of pyro, lots of rock and roll, nothing traditional. Okay. Yeah, it's all fun. It's, Absolutely. It's like, think maybe traditional rodeo and Woodstock had a baby. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, oh, so it's you know, a little bit of the best of everything, Yes, right? and then we finish the Western sports, and then we go straight to Alexandra K. She comes on stage, and then we finish the night with Charles Wesley Godwin. Oh, so, my gosh. It's okay. going to be cool. It's going to be That's ranked. a lot for one night, and you've been doing this. You were, we were just talking a moment ago. You've been on the road pretty consistently, right? Uh, yes. This is, this is this tour's ninth stop in a row. Okay. Um, and, and that's one reason we're doing this, because we don't want you guys to sleep on these tickets. We want you to get them ahead of time. Uh, yeah. www.bullsbandsandbarrels.com. Uh, they go up $5 the day of the show. So okay. we want you to get them now, save you a little bit of cash, and it's a family-friendly event. And, man, there's just not a lot of family-friendly stuff that you can bring the whole family, and there's going to be something for everybody there. Mm -hmm. uh, all gas, no brakes, and a whole lot of fun. <laughs> I want to talk a little bit about what you're going to be doing, because okay. uh, it's definitely not an uh, easy-going job that you have here. No, so I think I've got the coolest job in the world. Um, oh. I essentially get to host the biggest party <laughs> that's going on in the country in a different yeah. city every Saturday night. Um, I am the entering the entertainer, um, and obviously these bulls weigh 1,200, 1,600, 1,800 pounds. Oh, my gosh. They don't always do what we want them to do when we want them to do it. Sure. And um, so then it's where I get to go to work. I get to fill in. I'm kind of like the glue. I work with a event announcer, Matt Palmer. Okay. And uh, we just kind of fill in the gaps and sand it up and make it pretty and lots of singing, lots of dancing, and a whole lot of fun. All right, so you're staying on your toes the whole time. For sure. Yeah, For absolutely. Sure. For a lot of unexpected elements, too. Uh, yes. If you had to pick, and obviously there's so much to pick from, but if you had to pick maybe one big thing that sticks out to you that's maybe your favorite or just one thing you really are excited for people to see. Oh, the freestyle bull fights. Yeah. Hands down. It's one man, one Mexican fighting bull, 60 seconds. Uh, they have nothing but their wits and their feet. Oh, uh, man. They just got to stay out of harm's way as good as they can. <laughs> uh, these guys are crazy. They jump the bulls. They do flips over the bulls. Uh, and these pure-blood Mexican fighting bulls, they are unlike anything... They're actually the oldest domesticated animal on the planet. No kidding. They really are. So uh, they've been doing this like in the Gladiator Coliseums like 2,000 years ago, the same bloodlines that we'll have at the Civic Center this weekend. So oh, I think that's cool. Oh, my gosh. Okay, that's going to be awesome. And you, know, I do want to mention, too, speaking of tickets, we got a bit of a giveaway going on here. Oh, yeah. Got some information up on the screen, by the way. This is going to be on Saturday. Again, ticket prices are going to vary, so do pre-order. They're yes. going to be $5 cheaper, right? Uh -huh. So make sure you pick them up now instead of at the door. But uh, we do want to make sure we do this giveaway as well, Josh. For and, sure, uh, guys. And don't sleep on this deal. Uh, I promise you're not going to be disappointed. Oh, We're going to have a lot sure. of fun this weekend. Hey, you heard it from him first. We want to ask you folks at home, if you've been listening to the interview here, what is the official Bulls, Bands, and Barrels tagline? And you want to get a bonus merch gift certificate. What does it all mean? You can send us a DM on Facebook or shoot us an email if you can at 25newsnow.com or you can send us at news25 at gmail.com. And, of course, we'll have plenty more information online. For sure. And we'll have this clipped and ready to go. So, you know what, Josh, I cannot wait for this. Awesome. Honestly, this is going to be an amazing event. And, it is. Uh, turnout's going to be great. It is. Y'all come hang out with us. We're going to have so much fun. Saturday night at the Civic Center. Come see us. Absolutely. Thanks so much for being here. And, uh, hey. Best of luck out there. Awesome. It's going to be Thanks. great. It's going to be fun. And, of course, if you or someone you know wants to join us on In The Know, go to 25newsnow.com slash community. Go to the In The Know tab and submit the form. Again, you can also go to News25 at Gray.TV if you want to send in those responses or shoot us a DM on Facebook. We have got a lot to talk about with today's poll responses in just a bit, so stick around for that.